I remember my mother telling us stories about life in Puerto Rico. She told us that my father's mother was a witch and was even seen flying on a broom. My parents practiced spiritualism and lit candles to the spirits of the Indian. This was the only spiritual influence I had. No teaching about God who loved us or a savior on the cross. So what brings you in here? What do people come to a factory for when they don't have a job? This is interesting. Come back tomorrow. You'll start tomorrow. Hey, Joey. Good work today, man. You know, you're a hard worker. I like that. Can I share something with you? What? Well, did you know that Jesus Christ died for your sins? What are you, one of those religious nuts? I wouldn't say all that, but I am a Christian. Look, don't talk to me about God. I don't believe in God. I don't believe in the devil either. You know what? I don't want to hear anything you have to say. Fair enough. Just one more thing, Joy. Did you know that the four owners of this company are Christians? More than a third of the employees are as well. You know, we meet every morning for prayer. And tomorrow, we're gonna be praying for you. Well, you better pray that God delivers you from me. Because the first person who tries to preach that Jesus stuff to me, I'm gonna kill him. Joy, Jesus loves you. You're crazy! Jesus ain't real. else I can do under the circumstances. <laughs> and I do think it's for the best. Please thank you for having apologized. Mom! Oh, good. You're not gonna believe what happened to me today at work. I certainly wouldn't want to make things worse for Mom. you. Mom! I had this thought about killing a lot of people. Boy, why would you want to go and do a crazy thing like that? As I was thinking this way, this loud voice called out to me. It called me by name three times. And on the third time, I was shown my entire life. Boy, you're making the hair on my head stand up. It showed me how I was chained up in the basement. And when I was in juvenile homes and in the job corps, it showed me how I'd never been stabbed or shot. And when I stood before the judge about to do hard time, and never did. Oh, Joey! It's the spirit of the Indian. You've got to keep lighting candles to him. It didn't sound like no Indian. It was the Indian, Joey. You're crazy. You're always lighting candles to those Indians. Where are you 
money. Going out, Joey. Going to see my friend Izzy. He owes me some money. Yo, Big Bird. Yo, Izzy. Where's my money, man? I want it all, and I want it now. What's up, man? Calm down. I'll have your money tomorrow. Look, I don't care what you gotta do to get it, but I want it, or I'm gonna have to kill you. Hey, homie, hold up. I shot it all up, but I have your money tomorrow. Oh, you shot up my drugs and you don't have my money, huh? Well, now I'm gonna shoot you all up. What do you want, old lady? Can't you see I'm trying to kill somebody here? Here, young man. What is this? What are you, crazy? While I was in church praying, God told me to come to this street corner because there would be a young man whom he wants to save and use for his glory. And that young man is you. Oh, really? Really? God came to your church sat down, spoke to you, and told you to tell me this? You must be crazy. No, young man, it didn't happen as you said. While I was praying, God spoke to my heart and told me to come to this street corner because there would be a young man who he is calling by name, and that young man is you. I hate you! I hate all Christians! I'm fed up with all this Jesus stuff! God ain't real, and Jesus ain't real either! Jesus loves you! I hate you! I hate you! Jesus loves you! Jesus loves you! Joey! Joey, are you okay? Leave me alone! I'm fine! I'm fine! Mom, I saw a man in a white robe today. He told me that the evil thoughts I've been having of killing people were not my own, but from the devil. He said he had plans for my life. I've never seen anything like it. Oh, Joey, Joey, Joey. It was the chief, the chief of all the Indians that you saw today. He didn't look like no chief. You have the great Indian with you now. You're crazy. Look, Joey, if you don't want to believe me, then you're the one that's crazy. Just don't tell me any more about these visions of yours. I'm not crazy. I'm not crazy. <laughs>